Hello, what we have here is a 1 8 inch by 1 8 inch magnet levitating between two diamagnetic blocks. In 1842, Earnshaw proved the theorem that said that you must have an extra axis of stabilization to make a magnet levitate. And that's what we have here. There's lifting magnets above, and the magnet is being weakly repelled by both these diamagnetic carbon graphite blocks. What I'm going to do now is get it spinning with a soda straw. I'm going to blow through it. There it goes. The only friction is from air, so it'll spin for a long time. If you want to buy any of the stuff to do this experiment, you can go to otherpower.com or wondermagnet.com. And for less than $10, you can buy all the stuff needed to make this little experiment work. This magnet will probably spin in place for about five minutes. If you were looking for Earnhardt's theorem, you need to go to NASCAR.com. This is Earnshaw's theorem. The magnet's levitating about a 32nd of an inch above the bottom graphite plate and about a 32nd of an inch below the top graphite plate.